So imagine being a baby and you're crawling along there and you see all these people riding a bicycle and you want to get on a bicycle, but your parents are like looking down at you and going, no, 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 you crawl really, really well. So we just want you to stay crawling. We don't want you to get on a bicycle. It looks really cool, looks really fun to ride a bicycle, but you're really good at crawling. So just stay there and keep crawling along. And that was me. I was the kid that was crawling along, although I wanted to get on a bicycle, and I was the kid that was crawling along. If you guys stick around to the end of the video, I'm going to tell you what the hell I'm talking about. Hey, 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 guys, it's Jim Chandler with Rock Your Best Vocals, and I'm here today with you to do How to Sing Like Jeff Tate. I loved Queensryche. When I was just starting out singing, when I heard Jeff Tate sing, I was like, oh my gosh, this guy's got amazing range and I want to learn to sing like him. Jeff Tate has a very specific sound and we're going to go through kind of the techniques that he uses and his style and his method kind of for achieving that Jeff Tate sound. And it's a one of a kind sound. I'm going to take a track when he did uh, the eyes of a stranger with a, a, an, an acoustic set, which you can really hear the vocals really well. And they're not too far off the original. Okay, so there's a few things that you have to do to sing like Jeff Tate. You got to learn the cry method of singing. It's like, Oh, into the eyes of a stranger it's like that's what the cry is ah, okay so you'll hear him do that and the other thing is starting off scooping from the lows into the into the eyes of a stray so i'm just using that as an example but we're going to listen to him and i'm going to kind of imitate him to show you just to accentuate the techniques that he's using and he does use a lot of vibrato he also uses falsetto quite a bit and his falsetto is a very particular sound of falsetto so let's get into this and we'll just take a few take apart a few of the phrases that he's using and just to show you the examples of how you too can sing like jeff tate every time i try to leave it i mean so that's that scooping Every time I try to leave it behind me, every time, every time, so every time, oh, you need to start off, it's almost with that, I'm, I'm accentuating that a little bit, but every time I try to leave, okay, so when you scoop that, it starts off in the chest, every time, and he moves up to really kind of head voice there every time mixed slash head let's just go to the next phrase your rosary wrapped around your throat your rosary wrapped around it's almost borderline flicking wrapped around your throat wrapped around your throat allow He's there scooping again. I'll lie awake and swear afraid I'll fall asleep. Looking back at me. Oh. Into the vibrato. He scoops on the at as well there. Looking back at me. At me. What? what am I? Where am I? Okay, just I'm going back. Just as I was listening to the kind of mix down of the audio, I noticed um, he plays this on this one part here, this. At me. So he scoops up on the looking back. At. And then when he goes into the me, kind of, you can hear how he plays it safe going into me. He starts it off kind of a little bit by pushing through the nasal. Me. If you hear that back. Me, me, me. Which is kind of what he was doing, making sure he's get his placement is in the correct place for that note to come through. Me. 
So I hope you get the idea there. Anyway, back to the... Oh, oh. And, I and at the end... Oh, oh. And I raise my head and stare. And I raise my head and stare. It's very scoopy on that. So there you can see there's a few of the, the techniques. Okay, so now I want to listen to Take Hold of the Flame. We'll just take a little, a few of the parts there. This is really particularly to accentuate the falsetto that he uses. And I'll tell you the technique that he uses for that specifically to get that Jeff Tate sound on. Falsetto was always very sharp and very closed. It was not breathy. <laughs> a lot of people make this, the mistake of going, pushing a lot of air but Jeff Tate's falsetto was no! okay when starting off the falsetto you don't push a lot of air out but you do push some out through the nasal cavity no, no, no! so this next line is where you can hear a bit more of that cry sound Scream and cry, scream of pain and hunger. He's scooping down from above there as well. Away, which is cry. Away. So there you have it. If you want to sing like Jeff Tate, the original singer from Queens, right? All you have to do is do those few techniques. Do your scooping technique from below and cry. Wait a minute, I forgot to tell you. Remember the kid who was crawling and saw the people that were riding a bicycle and wanted to ride a bicycle? And I said, that was me. And I told you I was going to tell you about it. What it was, was my choir teacher in high school said, you are a baritone, so you're never going to be able to sing like Jeff Tate. So I struggled and struggled. I took a lot of different voice lessons from a lot of different teachers, thousands and thousands of dollars worth of voice lessons from so many different teachers. So I took a little bit from each one of those and I kind of blended them into my own singing style. And I am confident now that I can sing almost anything in almost any range, anything you want to throw at me, I can sing it. And that's from doing specific techniques that I've learned and I've taught myself over the years. So I have a course, if you want to click down below, where I can teach you all of these tools that you can have the confidence to learn to be able to sing anything that you want to in any range, in any style. And it doesn't matter how much you know now. What, what matters is, is that I can show you everything that has taken me where I'm at now. Now, I'm not saying I'm the best singer in the world. Of course not. I'm not saying that. But what I'm saying is you don't have to be happy being stuck where you're at. If you're struggling where you're at and you're trying to learn from YouTube courses, but you're struggling because you don't have the confidence to sing in front of other people and you don't have the power and you don't have the range that you want to get, and maybe you don't have the stamina, or you don't have the consistency, well, I can help you out with all of those. And also, in my course, I cover mindset as well, which is absolutely critical to everything else that you do, not only in your singing, but in life. But that, So that is a critical piece that's different than anybody else has to offer. So if you click the link below, and get on the waiting list for the course. Now, I put together this course because I didn't really intend on doing courses when I first started YouTube, but I've looked at so many different courses that are offered, and they don't offer what I can give you. And I'm not saying they're bad. A lot of these courses are really, really good. But I've had some of people that have gone to some of these other really, really popular courses come to me and say they're still stuck. So... I have a free course also down below if you want to try that out. What that will do is if you're a beginner singer 
that will give you some core fundamentals that will help you to develop your voice even better, okay, so from where you're at. So don't hesitate to take that free course. It's really valuable. It has the really core fundamentals of singing that will help you get to the next stage. And if you really, really want to take your singing to the ultimate level, to go from that struggling singer to mastering your voice, please click the link down below for the master vocal program and you can get on the waiting list. In that course is a six week group coaching course where we have Zoom calls every week where you get the chance to ask questions and you'll hear from others in the group and also a private Facebook group where you can grow with each other in that group. You can add videos there of yourself singing. You can ask questions in there and I'll go in and answer the questions. But it's a, re a six week highly, highly interactive course. So please click the link down below if, and learn more about that course. And if I don't see you then, thank you very much for watching the video. Take care. Rock your best vocals where your best keeps getting better.